Welcome. This is the energy vibration reading for the Aquarian Sun, Moon, and Rising. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. It is the 44th week of the year 2017, and the week begins from the 30th until the 5th of November. I want to say thank you to each and every person who has reached out to me to ask for a reading. I am so sorry that the readings have been late and beyond time, and this occurs because I am. I'm so busy I'm trying to move and <laughs> I'm, I'm had the flu and um, a lot has been happening in my life too people so not to worry your readings are going to be um, sent off and I want to say thank you so much for supporting my channel and for you guys this week you have the page of cups the page of cups is wonderful the page of cups is the energy vibration of new love coming in this is going to be a positive weeks for you Aquarian so if you're looking for love if you're trying to uh, vibrate with the energy vibration of love it's going to happen for you we have the energy of uh, the we have the energy of the page of cups coming in this is a good um, week for a lot of you women who wanted to get married and this is going to happen for you guys and for the women who wanted to um, um, be pregnant it is going to be a wonderful positive week happy 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 Halloween it is Halloween people I so love the energy vibration of Halloween it is one of my favorite holidays and we are going to look and see what is happening this is a good week for you Aquarians because we have the ace of swords as your energy vibration so this is wonderful because that the energy of uh, the, the the money money is going to be available for you guys in this week you Aquarians because we have the six of hazards we have the ten of hazard we have and I am using the the zombie tarot card because it's Halloween and I know a lot of people out there do not like it but it's Halloween so we are doing that and we have um, the ace of Pentacles the ace of hazard we have strength and we have uh, the tray of hazard so for you guys this week is a fire week because it's a wheel of fortune so it's gonna be a very lucky week and we have the energy the zodiac energy of water water so you have a lot of um, hurt energies that is going to help you so let let's see what is going to be um, extra messages that is going to come in ace of cups you have the ace of cups um, also here you have the organization um, you're winning whatever um, on justice that has been placed over you you have the Prince of Pentacles which is good and you have the princess of cups so you are going to be some of you are going to realize that you're pregnant and new love is coming in and you men are going to be connecting with the princess of cups so let's look and see how your reading is doing in this week the energies um, for you guys is going to be um, fantastic because you have the number five is a lot of changes a lot of changes will be happening for you um, Aquarians um, in this week okay so uh, whatever is happening a lot of you are going to be victorious over a situation an organization a lot of you are going to be victorious over a situation and an organization a lot of um, energies of uh, the hurt people are coming in to help you you have the princess of Pentacles who is going to help you to bring money in your life and you have the Prince of Pentacles that is going to bring you stability in your life whatever situation that you have been dealing with um, is the energy is going to change so let's look at Monday on Monday you have an earth energy you have the six of hazard the six of hazard is the six of Pentacles and you will be receiving um, love you receiving your money for some people and love for other people 
when we look at the energy of the six of pentacles it is always a time where we're giving or receiving and you guys will be receiving some will be receiving money and some will be receiving love the ace of cups uh, is here and the page of cups is here and this is what I'm saying is that a lot of people who find out in this week that you're pregnant um, or you know if you're an older person that you're going to receive a grandchild and it's going to be a boy so this is going to be wonderful because love is coming in and this love that is coming in is a positive love there's a lot of people who are going to come in and help you and bring you positive positive situation in your life and this is going to be good whenever we have the six this is always the energy of materialistic uh, um, your materialistic wants will be um, in need and be protective and with that is going to come in people who are loving you and people who wants to help you out people who wants to reach out and help you in whatever situation is going on okay as we move forward on Tuesday, we have the 10 of hazard, another hurt energy. So you guys are going to have a lot of balance in this week. The 10 of pentacles is always financial security. You have no worries over your financial security. This is going to be a week that is going to show you that whatever that you were worried about, you have no need to worry about it because um, financial abundance is going to come in. The Empress energy is here. Whenever the Empress energy is here, it is bringing forth and letting some of you ladies know that you are pregnant. So whether or not you knew that you were pregnant, you're pregnant for some people who will be expecting kids you are going to really realize that kids will be coming in your life this is going to be wonderful for some people because you have financial abundance especially for the women wonderful things are going to be happening for you happiness joy perfect um, felicity is going to happen for you with the family section because you are now financially um, abundant and your financial security so also your family a lot of connections with family um, money is going to be coming in but pregnancy is here in this week be careful in this week if you're not if you if you're not looking forward to get pregnant because it's a fertile week so for a lot of you women you could get pregnant in this week because new love is coming in but also um, the energy of uh, the cups the ace of cups which is new love and you have the energy of the page your Wednesday and your crowning of the week is a positive one because it's um, the ace of sword and the ace of sword is when you have used the sword to um, to break through whatever obstacles that was there you use the sword to break through whatever obstacles that was there and you stand firm against an organization or people who were being injustice people who were trying to break you down people who were lying and cheating this is a situation if someone try uh, or a group of people try to break you down or did something to block you whatever obstacles that they have set for you this is over your life is now going to flow you have victoriously used the sword to um, to break down the barriers to remove the obstacles um, to show the liars from the honest people and you stand up and use it to empower yourself in this week and this is going to be wonderful it's a wonderful week that people are just going to use words and use actions and behavior to break down whatever that has been happening on Thursday another wonderful day it's an earth energy you have the energy of the number one the ace of Pentacles this is good I love this week because it is the week of Halloween money is not going to be a problem to you on Thursday you're going to realize that a lot of money will be coming in in and the princess of Pentacles is going to be helping you 
to bring forth this positive financial abundancy that will be coming in your life I love the energy of the princess of Pentacles because that is a Taurus a Virgo or a Capricorn they're very business wise people they know what they're doing they always try to help other people to bring forward positive information situations in their life and this is going to be so wonderful so look forward to meeting the people who are the Taurus Virgo or the Capricorns especially Capricorns these are real business people loyal people they will help you with whatever situation they will bring you um, money in your life as we move forward on Friday not one of those really you know this is a positive day on Friday even though you have the three of swords in reverse that means whatever the situation is you have no loss um, you are just accepting things as they are you're moving forward um, whatever financial distress you have whatever you were feeling as if you were lost out in the cold something happened you feel lost and alone this energy is being reversed this energy is being reversed and this is going to be good Friday is going to be a good day because changes are coming in on Saturday we have the energy of strength and this energy of strength is really positive another earth sign person is coming in to help you this is a Taurus a Virgo or a Capricorn and this person is going to help you to change your existence and to change things in your life and to move you to a place where you need to be okay sometimes you can meet people who blocks your energy and blocks the energy around you and now you're going to meet someone who is going to help you to move you to some place where it's positive this person is going to see that you have the potential to grow and they are going to help you to grow okay as we move forward we are looking at Sunday Sunday we have another pentacle energy we have the two of pentacles so you're um, you're balancing off your materialistic world for some people so you're balancing off your financial situation so you're looking at your situation and that sort of a thing and you're trying to balance and make balances uh, um, to your life and this is very good because what is happening is that whatsoever that has been holding you back uh, as you look at that thing holding you back and not letting your financial situation grow you have just this came in the number eight energy so this is positive Positive. and it justice is coming in and said uh, this is enough you know whatever has happened and people were blocking you from uh, making your life uh, from growing because this is someone holding you back holding you back so you can't flourish and have the financial abundance that you need in your life and justice came in and said to hear and no further so whatever is happening you know that this week is going to be one of the most positive week because it is removing that which was holding you back it's like the devil of the energy uh, the energy of the devil that is trying to you know move you out of where you should be so as I look at your week um, I gave you the numbers the number five is a lot of changes happening new beginnings so a lot of negative things or being um, taken away out of your life new things are coming in be aware that um, pregnancy in this week this is a fertile week a fertility week where you can get pregnant so you need to be aware of what you do in this week because pregnancy is going to be uh, a, a huge a significant uh, um, that is happening for you in this week so be aware of this I'm gonna use two cards because it's Halloween and I love Halloween is one of my favorite favorite holiday I love Halloween so um, let's look and see what is happening this week love is going to play a significant role um, if you're a man you could be with someone who is um, a, a Pisces a cancer or a scorpion this person is going to be pregnant or letting you know that they're pregnant for you and um, a new baby is on the way for the men for the women it's going to be an energy that you 
are fertile so you can get pregnant so you need to be aware love is so powerful in this week because um, the love of children are coming in but yet still new love so if you are out there looking for a new relationship it is going to happen and um, wonderful situations are going to be happening the energy of uh, um, the organization a lot of a lot of people have situation that to do with organization and what is happening especially for the people between the ages of 18 um, to 65 what is happening in this week is that whatever injustice that has taken place whatever that you have been working with whatever that you've been working uh, people are working against you it's going to come up this week and finally an end is going to come to it okay I am using the wisdom of the house of night because it's Halloween so let's see what is the message for you Aquarians and you have the warrior and yeah this week is like a week of the warrior because you are trying um, to release yourself of whatever indisposable ability that has been placed on you because obviously um, certain things that was placed on you certain information certain things that was placed by you you're going to realize that you're fighting you're standing up you're going to empower yourself because you are saying till here and no further and this energy the warrior it says my beloved child when the warrior appears to you it is such a fortunate sight that to matter what is happening to you in your life you are truly protected so you know sometimes you're in situations you're wondering when is this finally going to end you have no need to worry because it's going to end soon because this week you're using the swords to cut through the the um, the, 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 the injustice the lies the untruths that was told and you're using the swords to cut through this so that you can re-empower yourself whatever you are experiencing right now all will be well if your question is regarding love this card represents someone who is deeply committed protected and, a, and kind to you and this is true because sometimes you have very very good friends who are really loyal to, to you friendship and love are, are sacred and these qualities are important for a relationship to grow if this person doesn't have these qualities then move on for you will send you for I will send you someone with a true warrior spirit instead remember life is about learning and discerning who is true and who is not okay I am um, you know discernment is one of the most important things in life because you need to discern the people who are speaking the truth who are true who are having your back you need to discern them you need to know who is really um, honest to you who is who really have your back do you embody these qualities yourself you need to embody these qualities if you in if you do not in embody the qualities of loyalty you will not receive loyalty in your life okay and now is a good time to think about how committed you are to your part okay so this is a perfect wonderful week you are going to have the energies of the warriors coming in and fighting for your right and helping you to re-empower yourself. So, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, this seems to be one of um, a positive weeks. And these positive weeks, you are going to see these energies coming through. The last energies I have for you. Not having enough money is never the problem, it seems. First, lack is always temporary. Secondly, change is only ever a few thoughts away. And the third, it's not like you haven't performed miracles before.
isn't this wonderful I want to leave this card up and I want to say to each and every person whatever may happen in this week come back listen to this reading read this card and you're going to start asking the universe for help to whatever problem and situation you are having in your life because money is just temporary lack is only temporary if you always think that you have a lack you will never better your life and you never seems to move forward to a place where wonderful energies are going to be I want to say to each and every person out there thank you for being here I'm wishing you a wonderful wonderful week enjoy Halloween on Tuesday and I'm um, saying namaste until next week